Set the record straight, the Jam Master Jake case looks at the twists and turns in this crazy 18-year investigation. Jam Master Jay, his real name, Jason Mizell, was killed in his own recording studio on October 30th, 2002 in a very high traffic area of Jamaica, Queens. There were people around at the time and there were five people in the studio at the time and there were surveillance cameras. So by our standards today, that's pretty much an open and shut case with witnesses and surveillance cameras, but it really was anything but. Jam Master J is hip hop royalty, a native of Hollis, Queens, who helped put rap on the map in the 80s as a member of Run DMC. There would be no hip hop and no rap without Run DMC. And there would be no Run DMC without Jam Master J. And that's really another great part of this documentary. There will be a trip down memory lane and viewers will get a history lesson about the origins of hip hop in New York City. They broke down all of the barriers for what hip hop is today. And that is important. So it's really uh, very insightful, very educational for anyone who remembers the murder at the time, who remembers the Renaissance in the 80s with Run DMC, because it's a good trip down memory lane and you learn more about the investigation. And then again, we have to pay homage to the visionary and the creative person that Jam Master Jay was and, and, and elevate that legacy above his horrible, untimely death. You will hear about his musical foundation before he became a DJ. And there's not one person that I spoke to that did not tell me how nice and giving and benevolent he was, how big his heart was.